So hey, uh, I've had a bunch of people send me this video and <laughs> I'm scared to watch it. It's called Solving the Mask so Shortage in Huntington Beach. And I have a feeling I'm gonna be filled with rage, but I just, okay. It's from a channel called Chad Goes Deep. Here we go. What's up dudes, we're here in Huntington Beach to solve the mask shortage. As you can see, no one here has a mask, but we brought our own supply to fix the problem. Guys, we've got a cure for the mask shortage. We've got masks. If anyone needs a mask, we've got them. You don't need one? Yeah, you might. Why not? I don't know if anybody has ever explained to you that breathing your own carbon monoxide is not healthy. I heard. Ah! <laughs> This is gonna get worse, isn't it? I heard about that, but I heard about this other thing. Called coronavirus? Yeah. Yeah, I know, but I'm not doing it. Nice. I know where I'm going when I die. You guys? Uh, I don't know. Going, I'm not the sky? Going. Hopefully to a there pokey shot. No, where, where do you go? <laughs> <laughs> I will say this is one of the things that kind of scares me about religion is that it, it means that the stuff you do on this planet kind of doesn't matter because everything goes on forever. Like I like the parts of religion where it's like care about other people, but also I think when, when if, if I don't believe in a God, unfortunately, I wish I did. I wish I believed in an afterlife, but also as someone that doesn't believe in something happening after, it, it makes me feel like what happens now, the way that I treat people, the way that I conduct my life, that means it matters even more. And just to reiterate, I don't automatically dislike people that believe in God and religion and an afterlife. I just don't like when that belief is used as a way to kind of be a fuck it to, to what's happening on this planet, especially when it pertains to other people, not just your own safety. And we continue. You go. Oh, you don't want to go to hell, do you? No, that would suck. Yeah. You know, the mass tells me I'm supposed to be doing something. Right. If I'm out here, nobody's going to tell me to wear a mask. Right. For sure. If we had a cooler design, would that make a difference? Excuse me, my man. We're giving away free masks. He's smart. He's socially distancing. <laughs> <laughs> I Dude, love this guy. What screen do you use? Just like a Walmart brand. Oh, nice. I just use like the 50 spray. This man, he's just a sheep. He doesn't realize that big sunscreen made up sun cancer. Did I say sun cancer? Skin cancer. Hello darkness, my old friend. Oh no, there's stupids infecting my mind. We can only give you a mask if you walk, wear it on the beach. We should I can't do it. Yeah. I'm walking 20 miles, man. It ain't gonna work. That's a long walk, dude. Congrats. You can't wear a mask if you walk. I don't know. Maybe it obscures vision. Oh, you need salt water kills this shit. If you're breathing salt water, it's healthy. I'm, Honestly. What? <laughs> Oh, dude, I'm gonna put salt on everything now. No, no, sea salt. Sea salt. Oh. All this salt, you can get fucking, it can kill you. What's your cost? That man is more concerned about salt you put on food, seasoning, than the coronavirus. Okay. Do you need a mask? No, thank you. Why not? Because I live here. What do you mean? I, I hey, oh, do you I guys don't. need a mask? <laughs> <laughs> Everyone knows the people in Huntington Beach. Immune. It's science, you libtard. No, we don't. Why? You don't? Because there's this thing called coronavirus. Really? Yeah. Yeah, yeah well, it's a bullshit lie. Really? Yeah, I know. Don't fucking Who made... What? Like, you know that people are ignorant and stupid, but then to see such blatant, proud stupidity on display is always rough to watch. Anyway. Who made up the lie? Hey, go fuck yourself. What? You heard me. He's pissed. I love that that dude's rocking a fucking chain wallet. Do you guys have masks? No. You guys are just going around willy nilly with no masks? Yeah. yeah. If I give you these masks, are you guys gonna wear them? Sure. sure. You swear on it? Yes. On Tyler the Creator? Yes, sir. <laughs> All right, dude. Oh, wow. I love these. All right, dudes. see you guys. Are you pro mask, bro? Do you want a mask? Thanks. It's all fake, dude. Come on. I'm good, man. Nah, man, that's just nah. that's a fraud, I like bro. I like freedom, dog. I like I like fresh air. I like I like freedom, freedom, dog. It's always amazing to me that that people being asked to do the absolute least act like it's oppression. To shut down the fucking country? That's bullshit, yeah, man. I'm good. But does wearing a mask shut down the country? When you close down half the economy, yeah. Yeah, pretty I much. think so. But can't we open it up quicker if we all wear masks? Nah, nah dude, that's a talking point not. on the TV, bro. Ah! It's okay to be distrustful. 
of the media and news. It's okay to be skeptical of stuff, but just to have blind hate towards the, the opposite viewpoint because it doesn't just vibe with you. What? What does that mean? Yeah, what does that mean? What? Do you know what a muzzle is? No. Hey, what's up, Rick? So fucking cool. Dude, Rick is the coolest, dude. What up, dude? Do you, you wear, wear a mask? God does love me. Do you wear a mask? What? I think he's oh, he's coming back. back. Do you need a mask? Come here. Get ready to run. What else you want? Just to give masks? No, look, if you're not making my fucking rights and not my rights, first of all. We're just trying to hand I out- I don't give a fuck what you're trying to do. You believe in a mask? I don't. That's cool. Fucking leave it alone, bro. We're just... If you want some of me, come on and get this. No, we're not trying to fight anyone. We just want to hand out masks. Yeah, we're, do you want the mask? Maybe we do a happy hour at Sharky's later. Don't be an asshole. How did this? How did this become such a crazy thing? How did this become... <laughs> you're breathing in your own carbon monoxide. If, if half the people in this fucking video, I believe, are huffing carbon monoxide. <laughs> Jesus Christ. And remember, all those people saying all those things have the same vote as you. They've got a hand that's as strong as yours and the steering wheel that is American. They're trying to swerve this bitch into a tree because paved roads are part of the deep state. And the swamp only want to install seat belts and airbags into cars because they want to fund their gay liberal agenda. Or something. It doesn't matter what I say or how crazy it sounds as long as I say it with confidence. But the main point is uh, or that daily reminder that <laughs> there's a lot of stupid out there in the world. But uh, you know what? I commend, <laughs> I commend these boys, these bros, for science, and that is where I'm gonna end this video because my head hurts and I'm I'm doubting humanity strongly again. Great, thanks. Bye. Thank you. Thank you. Go ahead. Next There's speaker, please. please. Uh, uh, sorry for the delay. I did legs yesterday. yesterday. <laughs> uh, but what up, council? My name is Chad Kroger. I'm an. Uh.